and welcome to this here vlog spot. I like to call it God, Math, and Metaphor, where I use uh, two things that I really like, math and metaphor, and relate them to things about God and maybe life in general. So usually I will probably take one specific principle about math and uh, relate it to God, but this is more of an intro. So. Uh, metaphor. I really like metaphors and symbolism. I enjoy reading them uh, in stories and I like using it in uh, poems, short stories, um, different writings. Uh, it's just a cool way to, um, I think, learn about ourselves, about God, just relating it to uh, something else, maybe more general in everyday life. And math is something I've taken a liking to I think in uh, recent years, uh, ever since I started working at Palo Alto High School, um, I believe this is my fifth year, and um, I'm a teacher aide. I work with a one main resource teacher and go into different classrooms. Um, I'm in three math class classes and um, help kids with uh, their uh, schoolwork and homework. A lot of it ends up being math. <laughs> a lot of the students really don't like math, so um, it's really cool that I can help a lot of them get through uh, their math problems. And I think uh, a couple reasons why I like math so much is because um, I really enjoy patterns and puzzles. And math definitely provides that. Sometimes uh, working on uh, maybe the higher algebra or trigonometry problems. It's like a puzzle. Um, maybe that's why I like Sudoku so much, using numbers. Um, it's just really cool, and I like the patterns um, that I see in math. So I guess in general you can see life as a math classroom with we are the students and God is our teacher. And it's up to us uh, if we want to listen to his voice. Uh, some of those students, they'll admit, oh yeah, every time the teacher's talking, um, I just, I don't pay attention, you know. And I tell them, you know, you got to pay attention if you want to get the, these concepts down. So, I think sometimes we treat God that way. Um, we're here in life and we kind of just tune out his voice. If we listen to him in whatever way that is, whether it be his scriptures or other people, or that still small voice in our heart, listen to him and you know, he'll teach us things about life. Math teachers love to give tests and I think the tests that God gives us, um, I kind of feel that it's more to um, make us stronger and teach us things rather than just see what we're going to do or see what we know. So. Yeah, I'm really thankful that God is such a great teacher. All right, well, thanks for listening, and stay tuned for more God, Math, and Metaphors.